I see some, some youngsters here living in the Western world, now maybe in the Pakistan and those countries too. They make a very special uh, styles of their hair. I don't know what, uh, what kind of material they apply, <laughs> any some kind of gel, and they, they, they made very interesting uh, designs and un understandable designs. They, they shave the whole thing from here and back and make the hair standing like this and sometime in us make the... I can't explain what I see, I see. I keep on seeing sometimes, I, I'm lost. What happened to him? And putting the gels and making these kind of things. The question is, whom you want to show this? Just I give you two, three questions. By doing all these kind of silly things, un-Islamic things, immoral styles and fashions and designs, my question is, what do you want to achieve out of that? Have you ever thought? Just ponder for a moment. Just think. Meditate in your heart. If anybody does these kind of things, what does he want to achieve out of that? Now I ask second question. Does he believe that with this act, Almighty Allah would be pleased? The answer would be? Does he believe by, by this kind of act, Holy Prophet ﷺ would be pleased? But Subhanallah, oh my beautiful Ummati, you have performed perfect, fulfilled right of being a Ummah, my Ummati and my servant. He would be pleased? Companions would be pleased? Oliya, Ghosul Azam radiallahu ta'ala no solaha and coming down and down and down and down, bring the whole chain up to myself. Would I would be pleased? Start from top and come to the bottom. I would be pleased? I have never done these kind of things in my life. Whom you want to please, I don't mean you, I'm just, I'm addressing a common youth. Whom you want to please to? Nobody. There is definitely somebody whom, whom whether you intend it or not, whether you know it or not, whether you appreciate it or whether you realize it or not. But there is someone who is pleased and his name is Shaitan. By all kind of these acts, Shaitan is pleased. By all kind of these acts, who is pleased? Shaitan. These are love in Quran, according to the Quranic terms. Love and love. And Islam says, Ishtanibul love. This is prohibited. You have to leave all these kind of silly things. And second, whom you want to show? Now second question. You want to show to your parents? Your answer would be? No. Then whom you want to show these kind of things? I understand whom you want to show and you also understand. Is this an Islamic point? Is this an Islamic way? You, can you consider that this is the way how a seeker should be? A true seeker? But to talk of becoming a traveler, salik, just a seeker, a talib. Can a talib, true seeker behave like this? Absolutely.